go. We we'll just, you know, Bush, Bush changed about 1,100 laws, you know, signing into law these uh, executive orders and presidential directives, and Obama been continuing on in his policies to where they outlawing their own law. Right, right. It's illegal to inform. Right. You know, illegal to even have water. Like if you got a lake on your property, that's going to belong to the feds. Yeah. You know, so th they outlawing their own laws of the Constitution with these executive orders that you people don't know nothing about. Right. right. You know, just to speak on what he's saying, these are unrighteous decrees. The Most High gave every nation their portion of earth. So how, how the white man, the white man gonna outlaw rain. Right. You know, it's illegal to collect rainwater. Right. You know, all this is in these executive orders, uh, transportation. All that's gonna be regulated. This is the time we coming into, man, the time of Jacob's trouble. Right. You know, just to piggyback on what the brother's bringing out, you know. Go ahead, brother. And y'all don't see that, man. Everything that this devil put in your face, you don't recognize it. All you do is focus on uh, the negativity that one of your brothers might bring on you, and you hate your own brethren more than you hate the so-called white man. Now realizing that the reason our people are so wicked is because the root, and the root of wickedness is this damn practice. Right. Yeah. This is Hosea 4 and 6. My people are destroyed for lack of knowledge. That's right, and his people are the nation of Israel. Negroes, Latinos, and Native Americans. Y'all destroyed for ignorance. Right. Y'all don't know nothing. Everything you know is wicked. Right. Everything you know will flow forward with you in America, which is going to be destroyed. So what you think you got coming? Right. You're going to fall right along with this wicked ass society. Not realizing what's coming at hand, which is the kingdom. But that's something y'all can't see with your own eyes so you don't believe in it. But yeah. you believe in this wicked society and everything that it teaches. Therefore, you get into our lies, you don't know truth. You don't have no knowledge. That's why our people are destroyed and walking around like the fucking idiots that they are. Right. right. Exactly, walking dead. Soon y'all gonna be physically dead. Right. Because thou hast rejected knowledge, I will also reject thee. That thou shalt be no priest to me, seeing thou hast forgotten the law of thy God, I will also forget thy children. Hey, and that's right. Y'all reject the Most High and his laws. He sent his prophets out here to the middle of the Lord doing this work week in and week out throughout the week, sit down. There's too many ways for you to get this truth, to learn how to come back to the law, statutes, and commandments of the Most High. But y'all reject that, y'all laugh, y'all scoff, y'all mock. So the Most High gonna reject you in that day. Right. He already done blocked you from understanding. He done gave you eyes that can't see and ears that can't hear. That's why we don't get caught up on a stiff neck, hard-headed nigga that don't want to hear the truth. Because we know the Most High not dealing with them. Right. Most likely wickedness, 
Y'all ain't looking to do nothing righteous. First of all, y'all don't know when the most high uh, set up the seven. If y'all know anything, y'all be at home right now meditating on the scriptures. But what y'all doing? Y'all soaking yourself in wickedness right now. In love, loving the little perks and bullshit gifts that Esau gave God. Right. Just to keep your dumb ass asleep a little bit longer. Yep. Until they don't need nothing no more. Right. Until they ready to try to exterminate your dumb asses and throw you in camp. Right. Shoot you down in the streets. Show you the devils that they are and how they look at you as pieces of shit dogs. Right. Cattle. And the rest were blood. According that is in, as it is written, God had given them the spirit of slumber, eyes that they should not see, and ears that they should not hear until this day. That's right. The most high blinded. He put that veil in front of you to where you can't see the truth. It could be right in your face, but you can't comprehend what you're seeing. Right. Somebody can scream into your ear, but you can't understand what they're saying. So in other words, he got you set up for, uh, for destruction. He got you set up for uh, the plagues that's coming. Family, martial law. If you don't make it, then you make it through all that. You ain't escaping the missiles. No. Nope. And once the most hot of, uh, it just blocked you off from the truth, only thing you can do is be subject to wickedness. Under the rule of this white man, because everything he touched, it just crumbled up fucking wither away and die. Oh. Malachi 4 verse 1. Oh, Malachi 1 and 4. Whereas Edom said, we are impoverished, but we will return and build the desolate place. Once again, Edom is your so-called white people. Right. The scum base of the earth. Right. That's the pride of y'all hearts. Y'all think y'all gonna continue to build and come uh, come into power and stay in power? Right. A couple of y'all dumbass crackers are starting to see that ain't gonna happen. Yeah. But for the majority, y'all gonna keep on trying to build up these wicked ass buildings, keep on passing laws, thinking y'all gonna bounce out of this uh, economic slump. We ain't no slump. This is a fucking downfall. Right. They can't do nothing but continue to go down until there's nothing left. That's right. Yeah. But we will return and build the desolate places. Thus said the Lord of hosts. They shall build, but I will throw down. That's right. And spiritually, you get body slammed on the ground right now. Right. All across the globe, brothers is doing uh, WWF moves through the spirit on your ass. Right. right. Y'all getting broken down, and we wait patiently for the time when the physical uh, breakdown comes. Right! When all this shit is evaporated. By what? Nuclear missile. Yep. There ain't no getting away from that. Nope. That blast will get your ass. Yep. But I will throw down, and they shall call them the border of wickedness. That's right. Y'all, the border of wickedness. Yep. Anything you touch, yep. around, get close to, turns to wickedness. Yep. That's why you see faggotry spreading like goddamn uh, local gossip in the hood. Ooh. Everything about this damn country, America, is wicked because of the so-called white man. Right. Niggas, Latinos, and Native Americans get mad at your own people, but who taught them with you? Who forced them in the ghettos and provided them with nothing but drugs and guns? Yep. And nothing else, no way to get good jobs, unless you sell out and be a faggot in this society. Right. So what Jay gonna do? He gonna grab what he got access to. He gonna pick up a gun and run. He gonna pick up some rocks and slay them. And that's what these white men want you dumbass niggas to do. Thinking you're going against this system, and you're the most caught up ones. Yeah. Who robbing with so much money through this damn court system. Keeping your ass locked up in these prisons. Yep. And that's this.